Yeah, holy it was gonna buy for one plus here with some one piece banners We just got the introduction of this new glint system I just kind of wanted to go over a few quick notes on some things you need to watch out for as you're leveling your characters or what you're going for and how some of these may be misinterpreted. First things first, if you're going for gems, you're not going to get that plus three gems for getting the sparkly title. All this does is give you a little sparkly title. I'll show you the animation, what that looks like here in a second. But what this series is, you basically just find it gives you a complete list of missions, what you need to do. Survival 100. Okay, easy. Bada bing, bada boom. All the browns ones are obviously going to be the easiest ones. These gold ones are going to be the most difficult. Now, what... This I want this brings me to my next point of just unlocking two hyper boost panels. Now hyper boost, you have to do the full hyper boost. Basically, they have to be hyper boost for. So I'm gonna go switch to a different character for a second and kind of show you who I have. I mean, there's gotta be some character that I have hyper boost. You'll notice on your boost two and three characters, wherever a hyper boost is unit that I have. Please, I have so many. Please show me one. Oh my god. There, Hawkins, right here. 52 out of 52. Now let's look at this. Look, you'll have that unlocked. This was the full boost, unlock two boost panels. For some reason, for those of you that might misinterpret, y'all may think it just may be unlocking two panels, like two blocks. No, you have to go the full 52 out of 52 in order to unlock this system. So keep an eye out for that while you are looking to do these missions. It is just a for fun thing. You don't get anything for it. It's just bragging rights to make you look good. So just to show that it's your favorite character. Obviously, Panda's not gonna give out gems for this because why would they? So, my next point brings me to the grind and like one of the other side missions that I do wanna focus on is going to be the completion of the five wins. This is now, obviously there's not many points. This is actually kind of rather intuitive. If you, there's any other questions, I will make sure to answer them in the comments down below. But I'm gonna go back to Drake, just kind of gonna show you the cool little animation that you get when you do complete the full missions. So. There is a mission where you have to win five games in a row. So that's KO seven characters in a single league battle. Now, this doesn't have to all be X Drake. Oh, no, maybe it does. Oh, no, maybe it does have to be Drake. Seven kills? Oh, my God, that's kind of a lot. Jesus, okay. Wow, that's actually, actually a lot. <laughs> there is a mission where you have to get five wins within it. Is it this one? You have to get five wins in a row. While you are doing this mission, this I think applies to many other characters who have this mission. While you're doing this one, you have to end the game with your character. So if you play the entire two minutes and 59 seconds of playing extra, then you die and respawn as literally any other character. It's not going to count as your win. So make sure you end the game. Now you can play. So say I'm playing extra and then I play a different blue character like Luffy. I can play Luffy two minutes and all three minutes and all two minutes and 59 seconds if i want but as long as i end the game on x drake that's what matters most that's where you get the win so you don't even have to play him all you have to do you can get the kills i think do have to be on drake so just keep an eye out for that one but this one you do have to end the game with the given character so this is just something i want to focus on make sure i let you guys know make sure you're aware of it i'm gonna be grinding out the big moms i kind of want all the big mom shiny titles i know that means i have to hyper boost them all so it's gonna be a long time but it's kind of shows as a little fancy little title. I enjoy it. And on top of this, when you complete the mission, you get to see a cool little sparkly animation that looks like this. Like, look at how lit this is. Oh my God, you go boosh, shing, rainbow sparkles. And then you shine, and then literally nothing else happens because it's irrelevant and you don't actually get anything for it. You just kind of get a shiny title that makes it show that you're special above other people. So that's all you get, that's all. Just welcome to Glintz, everybody. Thanks, Bounty Rush. To be honest, I do want to shout out them for the D ranker. If you actually go back, this is kind of a little side note. I know a little extra part of this video. I want to show you guys how they actually kind of are stopping people, hackers who use the garbage like point hacks. So people, if you are trying to grind like an Odin or a Shiki, basically those ones, it's, I think it's just Odin, Shiki, and Mr. Three. They have those hacks that allow them to sit there in a corner and keep spamming their abilities and just keep getting points and points and points which makes it impossible for people to get the character ranks. Now, what they did was disable the ability. Where is it? We have more details here. More details for the battle rewards have been downgraded. So like when you're deranking, but but people don't derank, they just get fat points. So they still climb anyway. So that we won't be able to stop them from climbing with this hack. But if one or both of the following, so when they repeat to failing to complete battles correctly due to disconnecting or other reasons or repeated suspicious actions indicative of losing deliberately based on operating conditions, score acquired, all that stuff. So the restrictions that we have, they will not be possible to progress in missions 
the character ranking score will not increase. That's actually huge. This is actually what we've been waiting for. This is a big step in the right direction. So big shout out to Bandai. I know everyone likes to dumpster them, but no one likes to give them credit when they actually kind of do something nice or good or well. So I wanted to give a shout out for that. But that is kind of just my main points of this video. I wanted to make it short and quick. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. That is our Glintz update. I'm going to be grinding Big Mom tomorrow. I'm going to be working on it. And I want to see how many I can get. Obviously, I don't have any boost fours, so that's going to be the one that's going to be majorly stopping me. But I'm going to try it. The green one's going to be a challenge. So anyways, I love you all. Thank you all so much for joining in and chilling here. I will be streaming tomorrow when this video is uploaded. And make sure you check, stay tuned. So be sure to like, follow, subscribe. Also, check out my Twitch, Twitter, and Discord. Would love if you guys join those. If not, eh, it's whatever. Fine, too. But I'm going to be Roman Puss, and I'm going to be taking off. Yeah, holy. Peace, beautiful people.